Hey, what's up, everyone? Uh, this is not going to be an actual, like, official Vegetarian Japan um, video, cooking video. But I just wanted to let you guys know something. An ALT in the same prefecture, but a different city, was left a whole bunch of vegan, vegetarian things. And she's just like, uh, I have no idea what these are, so I don't want them. Do you? And I said, heck yeah. So anyway, um, I just got back. I'm a little hungry. And I decided to bust out one of these items. It is vegetable meatball Japanese flavor. So I'm not exactly sure what that Japanese flavor means. If it's flavored like Japanese people. I have no idea, honestly. And it's, of course, it's all in uh, Japanese on the back. But, so something like this, right? Uh, fully vegetarian, and it's from a vegetarian store, which I need to find. Um, but the directions are in Japanese. But you can actually see what's that picture of. Yeah, it's boiling water. You put this whole packet in there, and you could, there's a little um, number three, and then the kanji for minutes. So... Boil the water, dump it in there, three minutes, it's good to go. You're basically just heating it up. Or you can use the microwave. It says uh, 500 watts for a minute, 30 seconds. So I just did that. It wouldn't be real exciting showing the water boiling. Um, and then I'm going to mix that. So that's meatballs. I don't have spaghetti noodles. Uh, I need to get them. But I do have salmon noodles that were left by my predecessor. And I know, I know, should not be eating salmon like this. Uh, it's a very thin noodle, and it's against all that is Japanese to not eat it properly, but it's okay. It will do just fine as noodles with my awesome Japanese-flavored meatballs on them. Um, so what's so good about salmon is it cooks in just like a couple of minutes. So I just dumped it in there, and seriously, it's nearly done once it hits the water. In fact, I should really find out how long it takes so I'm not overcooking it. Anyway, you take it from there. Normally how you would eat it, you would put it in a colander and drain it and then run cold water over it because you eat it cold with this uh, salmon suya, suyu, I believe, sorry. Um, it's this stuff right here. And see here, again, it's in Japanese, but uh, it's kind of hard to see, but there's a picture of salmon noodles. And you would tell that because they're very thin. Um, the other suyu is for... Um, uh, soba and soba is brown, so that's a huge difference. So it's not too hard really to find. Um, okay, so here's the other goodies. So we have um, these are basically just dried soy protein balls. So you kind of think maybe like you know tofu ish, but dried. So there's uh, this size um, like piece, well, marshmallow size maybe. And then here's like pea size. So same thing though. And some of these are from Thailand actually. So that's kind of cool. Um, what else? Yeah, I need more rice. We have, this is gluten burger, like wheat gluten. So it's ground up, like ground beef you'd, you'd use it for. Or instead of. Um, here's, sorry, here's some more uh, bigger versions of the soy protein. Uh, dried and what you do here is you boil water you dump them in there for a while I have to read that further um, and then cool it off and then squeeze the water out before you use it so it kind of brings it back to like a more tofu like flavor um, and then this is a vegetable soy burger uh, in tomato sauce so it's an actual patty in there very small but um, I would probably eat this over noodles as well um, what else? Last thing. Um, okay, we have textured soy protein, but this comes with a little uh, seasoned pack. It's a uh, chicken. So I'm actually probably going to use this, maybe with some noodles as well, some vegetables, uh, mix it all up. But those other soy protein things, uh, definite with curry. Like that's going to be awesome with curry. So anyway, my battery's dying, so that's all I have for now. Um, I will make those, and then I'll show you. So, see how they come out, all right? Okay, so here's what it looks like finished. I mean, simple. How long was that? Like, two minutes. Um, it actually took longer to really film this and to make it. So, quick salmon noodles, um, the little package of vegetable meatballs. Dress it up with a little oregano and a little pepper seasoning. 
So anyway, uh, I just tasted it, and it's fantastic, actually. Of course it is, right? It's vegetarian. So anyway, just want to let you know it did taste well, so uh, more to come.